Alright, welcome to part 28 of my Hocus Pocus playthrough. So in this part, we'll get through this level and the next level. Exciting. So we're back to the mummy ancient pyramid themes. So that's kind of cool. But also shows them being lazy. Be brave, victory is near. And yes, it is. We are so close to the end. Oh, how did that mummy not get hit? Whatever. Crap. They take way too long to spawn sometimes, but there's health, so it's okay. And mummies that can run fast. Like the ones in... Well, the mummy. The movie. Especially the ones in the second one. Chasing down a fucking double-decker. Oh, a smart bomb. Shoot it! There you go. No smart bomb. Man, I was having fun with those smart bombs. And we get a key. So we have to go use this key somewhere. Crap. As you can see, I'm being very careless, but there's a reason for that. The reason being, I can cheat and get my health back, so I really don't care. Ooh, health. Or I can just get health. Oh, wow, really? You're gonna pull that kind of crap? You really have to be careful jumping to those platforms. These bats did not make that crap. See, shooting those blue things makes things just more difficult on you. So don't do it. Because it makes it harder to land on the platform. So try not to do that. Back across the lava, platforming, stupid stuff. And we've been up here. Now, back here. An elevator, and this, of course, instead of opening it right there where it'd be easier for us, it opens it on this side, so we have to go all the way up here again, just to get the crystal. I mean, it's not even like they needed it to be longer. I mean, this playthrough already is almost as long as my King Kong playthrough, and that's a freaking PS2 game. This was way back in, like, 1994. T ten years difference, and this game's longer. That's just sad for King Kong. I think that game was 2004, maybe 2005. So some of these uh, things do have stuff in them, so make sure you shoot them all, just to make sure. See, that one had something, that one has something. That one doesn't, but this one does. No, it doesn't. This one does, but that one doesn't. Then this lower one does, but the top one doesn't. And then I think none of them do. No, the top one has one again. And then that one has one. Sweet! Bats, I hate bats. Bing up a ton of goblets. So this part, get the gems before you get the warp potion, because the warp potion takes you out of there, and that thing closes up. So, yeah. And then they try to trick you, put it on the other side so you go to the other side first, but I'm not falling for it. And neither should or will you. You know, if these bats weren't here, I could go through this section so much quicker. And I 
luckily have the silver key so I can get the crystal right away. What am I doing? I don't know. So more treasure and also more enemies. I don't have all the treasure, but I'm gonna get it anyway because I'm in a hurry. Oh, I did have all the treasure. Weird. No, level four. Quattro. Chick Quattro. The healing potion is hidden somewhere on this level. So there's one you're telling me, but actually there's more. Shit. Scorpions. Drop down real quick so I can kill them. Fuck yeah. I love how the background actually doesn't really fit the theme. Because that seems more like... Like a... Not really Egypt. Like a different Middle Eastern setting rather than Egypt. Because Egypt you think pyramids, not domes. And that's what I expect to see in like... I don't know... I don't want to sound culturally stupid, but it just doesn't seem Egyptian to me. So I'm just going to leave it at that. I'm not going to try to guess. <laughs> so we don't have the silver key, but might as well kill these things so we can get the firepower potion. And use this to kill some motherfuckers. These motherfuckers. One more left. Who will be my victim? Wow, that was a long drop. Oh, this is where I started. Ah. See, this is a split decision. You can go one or the other way. But if you go the other way, then this will be opened up for you. So definitely go the way I started. And you get the silver key now. Three more crystals. Crap, too fast. Two more. Halfway there. the silver key and another long ooh warp potion so that little area just kind of disappears after you start walking away so make sure you notice that and you don't miss it and another warp potion take us back there's the crystal I saw it or a crystal anyway she is it where am I going I'm going this way That was the last one. Now we got a gold key. Where does it go? Oh no, we didn't get the last treasure. What am I thinking? Oh wow, there's so much. Alright, well that concludes part 28 of my Hocus Pocus playthrough. I'll see you next time in part 29 where we'll take on level 5. And again, 
possibly even level 6 if we're lucky like this time. So, uh, yeah. I think I got 100%. I think I was fast enough. Let's check real quick. Uh, yes, see you next time, everybody.